Alrighty. Well, we're launched from Irish Road today, and uh, we were hoping to do the Cass River, but it was too low and too many rapid spots to be able to paddle upstream, and we have no taxi today, so um, hopefully we'll be able to hit that by the beginning of this month. So today we decided to go from Irish Road. We're gonna try and get all the way down to Mott Lake and then come on back. So it should be a nice trip. It's about four and a half miles each direction. Uh, water level is only about two and a half feet. Maybe, yeah, right around two and a half feet. I think the water flow is at about 360 cubic feet per second. So should be a pretty easy paddle today or you know, anything like that. Um, we're going downstream first and then we're gonna head back upstream. So, seems like a beautiful day. It's gonna be about 85 degrees out. Hope everybody's practicing their social distancing. And I'm out here with Bill today. And we're gonna get going. Melvin's out here navigating as well, so. Alrighty. Coming up to what could be our first and last obstacle, <laughs> go in this direction. We'll have to see. There might be a way through the foliage that we can go, but it might take a second to do a little clearing. It sure does look like it's all the way across. Think so? Yeah, maybe. Yeah, I think so. I think that's a possibility. We'll have to see. Yeah, it looks like it's open. Open enough. Yep. Yeah. See, this is one of the nice things about river travel, folks, is the fact that you never know from week to week what to expect and what you're gonna run into because trees fall at random and you don't ever know when there's gonna be a blockage or what the blockage is gonna be or whether you're gonna have to do a portage around it or whether you're gonna be able to get through it like we just did. So the river's an ever-changing place. Yeah, I might be dragging somewhere. This is doable. Yes, I did. Can if you have a hobby trap. <laughs> you that bullfrog? Frog alarm? Crazy. <laughs> Get 
Lots of different bullfrog sounds up in that marshland area. One of the several duck hunting areas come duck season, as de designated by the DNR. Kayaking today, buddy? Huh? Is it hot out? It is hot, right? Yeah. Stopping for a little breather on this sandbar area. Just up top of Mott Lake, right in the opening part of the Flint River. Getting a chance to stand up and walk around a bit. Melbourne's definitely warm. We are too. You too. Good. 
Beautiful day. Oh yeah. Perfect day. Yep. Certainly is. Right up on him from behind. We paddling all them. from his natural navigation position on the front of the kayak to laying on my lap. Get up to it. I can't get my paddle. It's above the water sock line. It's cold. It's above the water line. Yeah. That's yep, that's where I couldn't get past. There you go. I got it now. <laughs> I just couldn't get that past that one part because of the paddle. Yeah, I got it. because I couldn't get a paddle in without hitting the lawn. Good time today. We, are you happy we're almost back? Yeah, it was a hot day. You had to spend a lot of time down below, didn't you? Yeah, I know. He's a warm doggy. Yeah. Is that Bill there? Is that Bill? He's kayaking. He's kayaking. Both kayaks, aren't we? You're a kayaking dog. <laughs> 